back from the dead. Welcome back to the Madhouse, everybody. Much here. This time we're looking at the laser sniper rifle. Getting right into it, looking at the bullet spread. As you can see here, there isn't one. It is just like other sniper rifles, it's pinpoint accurate, whether you're hip firing or ADSing. Getting right into the stats of the gun, one of the bonus points about this gun is its clip size. The clip size is as many cells as you have in your inventory. Moving on to the damage, you're looking at 155 base, 226 with perks. Shots to kill, you're looking at two to the body, one to the head. Fire rate is 80 rounds per minute. Time to kill body shots is 0.75 milliseconds. First shot will damage, second shot will kill. Time to kill headshots theoretically is zero because that first shot should kill them, but that's debatable. Accuracy is 99. Range of this gun is 833, making it the longest range sniper rifle there is. Weight of this bad boy is 10 pounds. First off, I'd like to apologize how long it took to get this video out. Generally between work, recording the footage, editing it, I try to have a video out for you guys once every two weeks, if not sooner. But due to the fact that I'm a terrible hacker, the inconsistencies of getting the gun, the inconsistencies in the numbers with this gun, it took me a little bit longer to get this out to you guys. Alright, let me first off by saying I have never been so frustrated trying to test a gun in this game. There's the first part where if you get the grounded mutation without it being a serum, it can reduce the damage of this gun by something like 50%, thus turning this gun into a giant paperweight. On top of that, sometimes this gun just doesn't give you the two times damage multiplier for shooting a person in the head. Add that all in together with the simple fact that you're shooting these guys basically with a giant flashlight letting everybody know where you're at. I personally cannot recommend using this gun, it's just a pain in the butt to try and use. But if you get your hands on it, let me know what you think. Maybe I'm wrong on my opinions. Let me know. Anyways, until next time, thank you for watching. Hope you got something out of this video, and I'll see you in the next one.